your father and I are very concerned about you. Go away. <laughs> Open up, young lady. Niles, run and get a butter knife. Oh, why don't we just starve her out? <laughs> Ma, use your nail. Her nails can open anything. Letters, diaries, my old boyfriend, Chevy. I never had any privacy as a child. <laughs> Got it. Acrylic. Cece. I don't want to talk to you. All right, I'm coming in. Cover me. <laughs> Smoking is not in my house, young lady. It's not your house, and this is none of your business. And while we're having this little girl talk, I loathe you. <laughs> At least you're opening up. Now, I want to talk to you about your father. You have got to stop pushing people away. I don't push people away. Excuse me, I'm trying to get some ash out of your hair. People misunderstand me. They think I'm a self-centered, cold-hearted witch. <laughs> Is everything all right? If they're like my Morty, they could be in there for hours. You know, Fran was right. I should have spent more time with Cece when she was little. Oh, Miss Fine has this annoying way of being right about those things. Yeah, yeah. Meanwhile, if uh, you need another escort for the concert, this outfit uh, goes from day to night with just a few accessories. I have the knife. Oh, that's all right, Niles. We don't need it now. <laughs> the thing is, I just don't know what to do. Oh, there, there. That's okay. Yeah. Okay. Shh, shh, shh. That's all right. Hello. Calling next of kin. Uh-huh. Yeah, here's your daddy. Here's your daddy. I have never seen her cry before. Well, maybe the crash of 87. Oh, yes, go to the concert. I would really love it if uh, you would come with me to the concert tonight. You would? Of course he would. And Cece, I think you are very lucky to have a friend like Fran. I know. <laughs> She's wonderful. She's gonna let me wear her 